So, uh, Professor Liu is going to teach you how to do number five. Number five is a Roman numeral converters, and you want to write the program X user to enter a number between one to five. So, if one and you convert to I, capital I, two and it's I I, three is I I I, four is I V, five is V. How many selection? How many different selection do we have? Anybody? How many selection do we have for this number five? Good, five. So remember what is mentioned about five to fifteen, five to twenty. So number five will be. You will use what kind? Uh, 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 structure. We just learned it. Switch. Let's use switch structure right now. Okay. So, gentlemen, ladies, we are going to have input, okay? Input number is okay. So, input number, then we are going to have a uh, Roman, uh, Roman letter, okay? So, let's do it right now. I am going to copy this, Control A, Control C. So, file, <coughs> close all, solution, and I am going to create new project, uh, C++, and this will be um, chapter uh, 6, class or underscore 5. Alright, so right click right here, right click, I'm going to add a new item, alright. So I'm going to change the name to match it. Chapter six, class work underscore five. Okay, control V. And I'm just going to delete this kind of thing. And I'm going to have a uh, integer input num. It's okay, input num. And uh, the output, and will be okay so this output will be string is that right all right so let's take a look at the output because some of them you know so output will be a string it's okay so we are going to say this say string uh, oh sorry i have to uh have this right here okay so i am going to say this is uh include string sorry All right, so I include string right now, so should, they should be happy. So then uh, I'm going to say uh, string is a Roman letter. It's okay. Now, we got this right now. So uh, we are first going to ask user to enter an uh, input number. Is that right? Okay. So I'm going to see out. <coughs> Enter an input num. Okay, enter input number. All right, so I'm going to put this one uh, to five only. Okay, because um, we're just going to do one to five only. Uh, later you can do more. Okay. All right. So then now see in here will be input num. Okay. So I got this right now. All right. So now I need you to type switch. Okay, everybody, are you here right now? And you type switch. All right. And tap. Switch and tap. All right. Switch and tap. And then you are going to say this. Uh, switch on what? Switch on instead of switch one on. Um, can anyone tell me what variable I should put right here? It's input num or Roman letter, huh? Any? Roman letter. No, think about it again. You switch on what? Input num. That's right. Good job. Good job. You switch on input number. Is that right? Okay. You you always put your input. The other way is you always put your input here. Is that okay? 
and output will be vary. Output will be different selection. So you put input num right here. All right, so I have this right now. How many case do I have, boys and girl? Right now we did it. How many case do we have? Good job, good. Can you work with me together? Put case one, okay, and sweet, uh, break, okay. Then copy paste is okay, and do five of these. Control C, then Control V, Control V, Control V, and Control V. All right, then and do two, and do three, and do four. Oh, sorry. And do five. It's okay. And the default thing don't need to have break. Can you do that? Everybody have this five case done. Hmm. Uh, yes. Yes, hon. Mm, not necessary. Who have a default is good because we want to control. If I don't have default, uh, I cannot control. People do six or seven. Do you understand? So if you do seven or six different value, your program will stop. You rather your program stop or you want it to, you know, uh, deal with every single case. I, I mean, as a programmer. We have to figure out if they enter wrong data and how do we uh, manage uh, the wrong data. Is okay? Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, Gregory, um, you know, sometimes it's just twenty. Is there's nothing like uh, has to be like that? But if uh, twenty twenty one, you know, once it's going too much, like you know, whole page, and it's very difficult for user to do it. Then that time you don't want to use switchman. Is that okay? That's a very good question, by the way. So let's do this right now. So case one here, case one here, and I'm going to say this, okay? So Roman letter, equal uh, I, all right? And case two, I I and case three I I I right case four I V case five is V all right so what do I say for the default? What do I say the default?
No, uh, yeah, yeah. So we we got to we we cannot put negative one here, because uh because the uh Roman letter right here is string. Is that right? Okay. So we can do like this way. We can do uh something to indicate uh. Yeah, you can put false. That's good idea. Let's put put. Yeah, that's good. All right. So all right. So I am going to uh put like this right here. Say uh Roman letter huh equal false. Yeah, that's good idea. Uh, I'm going to just put the uh false. Okay, fine. Right now, okay. Uh, here. Uh, there's a lot of work need to do, so I'm going just to false, and I'm going to do this. Okay. So, if okay, uh, I'm going to say Roman letter, Roman letter. Okay. Uh, equal equal. Equal equal ah uh, compared to So here I uh put a new thing here, okay. Um, uh, we put this and compare to. So equal equal zero means these two are exactly the same, exactly the same, okay. All right. So uh, let me run it and I'll give you more explanation on this, okay. So I build it. And I start without debugging. Okay, so I'm going to put a uh, three. Three is that uh, okay? So I'm going to do this right here, here, and one more time. I'm going to put ten. And invalid, invalid input one to ten only. So here you need to learn a new thing here. Okay, uh, because uh, it's uh, not one character. Uh, not only just one x, so you cannot do to upper to lower. So this one we have to, uh, kind of, uh, care about the user to do something. So I'm just do false and uh compare to, okay, equal equal zero. All right. So uh, this is a switch statement too. Uh, I add a new. Type new uh method new function called compare. All right, so um it's still a five uh between the five to twenty, so we still use uh sweet structure. I hope uh you like this program. Okay.